Well, quiet weather continues now for most of us over the next several days. We're in the uh, wake of a front that actually brought us widespread severe weather earlier this week. Temperatures have dropped considerably since earlier this week. Our dew points have uh, followed suit, and we should say sunny and dry for the most part all the way through the weekend. So here's a trough of low pressure. Again, this is in the wake of that front. We had uh, a lot of cooling taking place. Those dew points dropped considerably, and that should stick around over that next several day time period. Now, the extended outlook into the early part of September suggesting that we may be a little cooler over the Great Lakes region back down into the uh, central and southern U.S., maybe holding on to some slightly warmer conditions along the coast. But yesterday, again, most of our severe weather occurred over the mid-Atlantic states with a few wind damage reports on uh, Wednesday. Not quite as active, though, as it was on uh, Tuesday. And today, other than maybe a few isolated thunderstorms of the mid-Atlantic states, again, we're pretty quiet. Friday, even quieter across the region. And Saturday, maybe a few isolated rumbles of thunder out of the outer banks of North Carolina. So lots Lots of sunshine. There could be a little bit of uh, very light precipitation drifting across the eastern Great Lakes as we take you into the end of the week. But again, this trough of low pressure is really going to scour out uh, much of that cloud cover and uh, keep us pretty dry. So this is all the way out through Sunday morning. And again, other than a few little blips here and there, we should stay mostly dry across much of the region. 68 degrees today in Buffalo. Cool, but uh, very comfortable from New York down to D.C. And tonight could be a little bit on the cool side with 40s to the far north.